Yeah. We're rolling. Yep. So what it was, it was such a long we're going to do first so is look the, for the queen the uh, because we're going to take the outside of this and we're going to vacuum so the bees like on the outside. So we're just looking for the queen so we don't vacuum up her. More than likely she's back here. So I don't see her. So let's get some of these bees in so we can cut some of that comb out. Okay, I'll let her go. Let her hang out with me. So we got some out. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take some of this comb out. We're gonna start taking it out and put it on the on the frames. That's where things get a little hairy, huh? A little bit. <laughs> because it's smaller to keep into place. Oh. Is that all the honey that just came out of that? No, this is, this is baby bees right here. The queen's laying eggs, so she has a lot of babies in there. So what are those guys trying to protect the babies? Or are they caring yep. for They're the actually babies? just caring for them. Is that what they're doing? Yep. Let's look for the queen again. It is, it's just, the, roof, the sun is deflecting in my eyes. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Let's take some more out. So see them, they're all eating the honey because they're stressed. So the honey calms them down? Yes. Yes. Calms so, them down. So they a eat lot. their feelings basically, like I do. Like, like, every, like we do. <laughs> I always eat my feelings. Oh. <laughs> Alright, let's get some more. Now, traditionally, we put this the other way around, but it's not long enough to fit into this comb. So you kind of have to balance frame, it I mean. in there for now. So I have to balance it until they make it bigger. Yep. Oh, did you see all them just fall off? <laughs> Combs are coming out now, Ronson. Find her. I'm found the queen now. Unless she got sucked up. She might have, but I. I she probably is hiding behind 
we still got more, a lot more to go. So there's right. going to be one frame of bees. Again, it's upside down. They're going to secure this. They're going to build up on this, and then they're going to chew all that those rubber bands off. And you'll see them like in a couple weeks. I'll look inside the bottom of the hive, and you'll see a whole bunch of chewed rubber bands coming out. No kidding. Yeah. That's cool though that they know what to do. Yeah. Look right there. Oh, yeah, I see it. He's watching too. Hey, buddy. So you might be able to, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but no, you won't be able to. I'll check. We'll check in a little bit. There should be uh, a lot of bees in here in the bee back. We'll check when I get down. Get stuck in there like, oh, we're going to work. All that work. All right, I'll look for the queen. Any honey in there yet? Uh, there's nectar in here. They just haven't made it into honey yet. Oh yeah, the that, chocolate she honey. She said that was amazing. Can you see the orange nectar or yeah, the pollen yeah. that they packed in there? Yeah. This is nectar that they're going to make into honey. Is it dripping? Is that what I just saw? Yeah, because it's too wet. So oh. they bring the nectar in and then they fan it, fan it, fan it. And then once it gets down to about 16% humidity, they cap it off and that's when you have honey. They're so smart. What a science, little scientist little creatures. They really know? are, right? They're amazing. And they're incredibly gentle. No. <laughs> All right, let's take this one next. I gotta run down and get a eyelet. You might want to watch the counter. Now, what holds that on? Running rampant in the shop. All kinds of nature today. It's just like the nature show today, right here in Woodsville, right? Loving it. Yeah, that backing plate worked out good to keep the combs right where we can get at them. Yes. It's kind of an ideal situation. Yes, it really is. Now, is this one of the easier ones you've done? I actually have only done like two of these inside of a container like this. Yep. Um, and this is definitely easier. <laughs> The swarms are the easiest because it's just a big cluster of bees on a branch. And they're very easy because you just shake them off and let them go. I think that's what keeps them from stinging you, the nectar on you maybe? You know, I'll be honest with you. No, I don't know. Because they're just, they're not mean whatsoever. They're calm. They're very, I mean, look at it. I know. It's, well, it's I'm, I'm sitting know. here and... They're probably like right by you. Yeah, they've been on me. Get you or was it just on you? No, I just it was just on oh, me. It was on him, he just vacuumed it <laughs> yeah, up. I vacuumed it off. That's one way to get rid of That's where they're all hiding. That's where they're all running right now. This comb is very, um, it's newer, you can tell. And it's very fragile. That one can break pretty easy. Yeah. So I'm trying to be really delicate when I'm touching it. So it just hardens over time? Yeah. 
and they're dirty. Like that one you had me touching, that was like hard as rock. Yeah, yeah. That pre premium one you had. On yes. That, they had made. that was probably made like last year, so it's, it's hard. They should feel it. When it hardens, it's rock. It's perfect. Bigger bee on the back side here. Oops, a, she's right there. The queen bee? Just went up in here. She had a oh, bigger oh, abdomen. Oh, on, on. on the upper cone? Yeah, she, she just oh, went up back to up to the top here. Oh. Let's go see. I just happened to see her one different than the rest. Two more big pieces of comb. I'm going to try not to break this one because all this right here is babies. Yeah. Right there. Would she go on the back side of it, you said, Sean? Yep. She, oh, she came up in. It was a different, here. looked different, so. This is a drone right here. This is a boy. That's what I saw. This okay. is a drone bee? Okay, that's what I saw then. Yeah, they won't sting you. you can, really? Yeah, they don't have stingers. Oh, so what do they do? Their only job is to mate. Oh. So the drones typically go in a place they all hang out. If they see a queen come by, then they mate the queen, and then they die. Oh, I was gonna say the, the drones got the best life of all. No. Me too. No, but they, they die. die. <laughs> but uh, they also get. Um, they can. They're the only ones that can go into other hives. So oh. the drones can go into any hive where the workers can only go in their hive. No. So, and like right now the drones are getting kicked out because it's getting time to like with the winter coming. All the drones are getting and kicked out, and they're all gonna die. No kidding. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so they got the shitty end of the job. They do. Yep. You don't want to hurt that one because it's full yeah, eggs. Yes. I'm gonna try. This is gonna probably be a little wonky over the winter, but that's okay. We'll leave it like that because I don't wanna. I don't wanna hurt this one whatsoever. A lot of babies in that one. Huh? Tons. Well, it's gonna put a boost on your little colony. Yeah. It's awesome. I'll have to come see him sometime. You should. You should. Anybody's more than welcome. I'll bring, gotta bring the kids up. A 13 year old. Oh, that, she'd that's probably a, be perfect for her. That'd be a good age. Well, she loves anything nature. Yes. Cool. That did break just, a little bit there, you can see. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So the, when you see it, the, 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 the,
So you see that? Hey, they broke open. You can see the babies in there, the larva. filming this for me. Yeah, not a problem. It's gonna be a long video, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, 28 minutes right now. Wow. Let's split this one in half, though. Right here, because I split that. That last one broke. Yeah. And they would be clustered around here, so I think we got her. Then that one where they are all clustered. There she is. Crazy, you got stung. She's in his hand. Right? Oh, wow. I mean, she stand right out. Oh, yeah. She does. She's a big girl. Big long abdomen. She's kind of an <laughs> orange. Her abdomen is kind of orange. That's her. You got her. You got her. Do you want me to hold that while you get her? Here, if I turn this this way. Where is she? She's trying to bury herself with the mm -hmm. rest of them. You have a good eye. She's getting in underneath there. She's getting in all of them, isn't she? Yep. There she is. There she is, right there. Got her? Let me take a look now. There she is. Now we got her. Come, you bugger. Oh, you fly away. You get in there. She's not very. I'm still scared. in, is she? Yeah, she really is. Get in there. Please. <laughs> The thing about it is she's not... She's not a sting in you. Don't you fly away. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, you bugger. <laughs> Almost had her in there. Almost. Whoop. Okay, girl. There she is. She in there? Yep. There she is. See her? Oh yeah. She looks totally different than the rest she of them. Is huge. Yep. John, check this out. Oh, you got her? Yeah. I got it all on camera. Too. Oh gosh. <laughs> Let's get to 
Seriously, these bees. She's the wanted one. She's the wanted one. this here for a while because maybe they'll start to go and I'll have to come pick this up later on tonight. Mm -hmm. well, we're going to have foragers coming back for hours now because they're out foraging. So mm -hmm. we'll wait till these cluster, vacuum up again and then uh, load the car back up and then come back and vacuum again and just keep doing it for a little bit and then come back tonight. That's it. Thank you very much. Thanks for recording. <laughs>